Well, Pete, uh, let's put it this way. I mean, it's late in the day, final day of the January transfer window, but there is a very real possibility that Chelsea could still finish, sign off from this bonkers window uh, by signing a World Cup winner for a British record transfer fee. That's because those talks are still very much ongoing between Chelsea and Benfica for Enzo Fernandez. It's important to stress that no deal has been agreed, uh, but what we do know is that club officials are in Lisbon ready to give him a medical should that deal be agreed because of the time uh, scale involved here and the fact that this is uh, incredibly late in the day um, it, it means that essentially there won't be any problem with a medical if a deal can, can be agreed but that is the crucial sticking point the only sticking point in this is the structure of the deal remember Enzo Fernandez has a release clause of 105 million pounds that's something that Chelsea have bid but of course Benfica wanted that in a in, in a, either a one-off summer or very, certainly not far off that Chelsea don't want to do that they want to do that in structured payments uh, even if it ends means uh, you know over the long term paying more than the release clause as long as they can do it uh, in those structured payments to avoid all the hassle of financial fair play and, and tax uh, all of the tax reasons as well so uh, that's the situation those talks are ongoing they're still Chelsea desperately still trying to hope that they can find the breakthrough and add Enzo Fernandez into a squad of players that has been revitalized in this window they've brought in Mudrick they've brought in Felix Barry Shale they have brought in some good young players some players who have already made an impact we talk about Mudrick coming on against uh, Liverpool and showing glimpses of what's coming there as they aim to claw back Chelsea that 10 point gap that exists at the moment between them and the top four as they bid to qualify for the Champions League next season but I do stress no deal agreed yet but talks very much still ongoing OK Paul fascinating we'll keep a close eye on it